You know dog owners. Do you have to feed their dog? Do you have to walk your dog? And you got to love them, train them. But when it comes to uh, walking your dog, some dog owners have the tendency to not stoop and scoop after the dog. And this month we hear from uh, two dog walkers, uh, women, uh, Lucy Mills and Ellen Kelly, who are two dog walkers. Uh, they run their own dog walking business uh, over in uh, Bristol, uh, England. While they were uh, walking uh, some uh, dogs, uh, they end up uh, picking up uh, 80 different uh, dog poos in 90 minutes uh, during an attempt to clean up a uh, town center and uh, like the local parks as well. So, Lucy Mills, uh, she said there was, although there are signs uh, warning people to clean up after the dogs, known as a uh, stoop and scoop, uh, but there is a lack of uh, enforcement and just some people are so loud, even not follow these rules. The Poway uh, uh, County uh, Council said it was up to the dog, to dog workers to be responsible to clean up after themselves, uh, including uh, people uh, people uh, walk their dogs, uh, pet owners. But Lucy is saying uh, she said there was a lot of uh, people ignoring these rules. Uh, In which she said there doesn't seem to be a big problem with dog poo around that place. Uh, and compared to uh, in that small town of uh, Br Bristol and where she lives now in Brecon, uh, there's a lot of uh, dog poo everywhere. Back when uh, she lived in uh, Bristol, uh, you got uh, not stooping and scooping after a dog, you would get caught for uh, not stooping and stooping. But uh, over in uh, Brycon, people, they don't care. And although uh, Lucy, uh, they'll say, uh, uh, thought about uh, Brycon is a lovely place. Uh, and attracts a lot of tourists uh, who come for walks in the parks and that but they have to walk through a whole bunch of uh, dog poo and it just uh, makes the experience just horrible for these people so Lucy and uh, Ellen they uh, work together and they spend like uh, an hour and a half uh, for their cleanup, but only uh, got like a only got like a tiny bit uh, cleaned up because and also their dog walking because but you know like so much dog poo that they have to deal with. And again, big rule. If you're walking your dog in public, you got to stoop and scoop. Everyone who owns a dog knows that you're supposed to carry poo bags and you're supposed to pick up after a dog. And she said, this is just laziness and people who just don't want to like do the right thing. And they expect other people to do the job instead of them doing it. And Powys uh, County uh, Council uh, over in uh, Brecon say uh, 
of the minority of the dog owners who let their communities down just doing this. And over there, they're also, uh, they have said, as uh, a spokesperson say, we have a uh, waste awareness and enforcement out and about adding signs and engaging with dog owners with whilst our street cleaners are doing their best to clean up after the irresponsible few who refuse to take responsibility for their own pets. It is an offense to allow a dog in your control, even if you're walking someone else's dog, to fall in a place and to fail to clean it up immediately after it has fouled and could be issued uh, with the 75 British pound uh, fixed penalty notice. And with the other countries, uh, there and there also uh, similar stuff like this. Uh, there are like bylaws by enacted by towns and cities everywhere you go, and it is a standard rule: stoop and scoop after your pet. And anyone who uh, refuses to do stuff like this, you're a dog, bad dog owner.